I'm meteorologist Mark Van Cuso, and on this day in weather history, August 24, 1992, the granddaddy of the 1992 Atlantic hurricane season struck Florida. Hurricane Andrew became the third Category 5 to make landfall in the U.S., packing winds of 165 miles per hour and a minimum low pressure of 922 millibars. Andrew formed off the coast of Africa on the 14th, and under the influence of a ridge of high pressure to its north, it quickly tracked westwards, developing into a tropical depression. It gradually intensified after developing an eye and reached hurricane status on the 22nd southeast of the Bahamas. It rapidly intensified to a Category 4 as its pressure dropped 47 millibars in 24 hours. Florida suffered a 17-foot surge. In Dade County, 90% of the homes had damage. Homestead Air Force Base took a direct hit and was closed as a full active duty base and later partially rebuilt as a small air reserve base. Offshore of the Gulf states, Andrew left a half billion dollars in damage to the oil industry. The storm was a storybook hurricane that caused over $26 billion in damage, the third costliest in the U.S. history. I'm Mark Mancuso.